हेलो डियर टीचर्स वेलकम टू माई चैनल सो नाउ टॉकिंग अबाउट द लेसन प्लान फॉर द चैप्टर फाइंडिंग द फरी कैट ऑफ क्लास वन मैथ्स जिस्ट ऑफ द लेसन दिस चैप्टर ब्रिंग्स अटेंशन ऑफ द चिल्ड्रन टूवर्ड्स द बेसिक पोजिशन वर्ड्स मीन्स थ्रू अ स्टोरी चिल्ड्रन विल लर्न द स्पेशल रिलेशनशिप्स ऑफ द थिंग्स नाउ टॉकिंग अबाउट कॉम्पिटेंसीज इन मैथमेटिक्स वी कंसिडर बेसिक थ्री कॉम्पिटेंसीज first one is knowledge and understanding basic concept then second ability to compute and third one is problem solving ability so first competency means knowledge and understanding basic concept of spatial relationships of the things around them then ability to compute able to differentiate vocabulary in relation of spatial understanding and at last problem solving ability means able to use the relative vocabulary in their day to day life this will be our last competency now talking about the outcomes first general outcomes for this chapter understanding of pre number concept sorting the things identify things around them so these are the basic outcomes that we consider almost in all the topics of maths then talking about specific outcomes know and learn the spatial relationship read the words used for different position of the things enrichment relative vocabulary as inside outside top bottom etc able to use position words in their day to day life effectively now coming to the activities plan for the topic first is understanding the concept of spatial relationship through reading the story and seeing the given pictures as we can see in the textbook there are so many pictures shown for the particular spatial words then class activity for using the given position words through pictures and worksheets practice of the above concepts creating a story using the position words let the students create their own stories using the Uh, given position words in the topic then sorting activities using seeds leaves beads etc activity for hoisting the national flag and knowing basic etiquettes for respecting our national flag then sharing experiences of their train journey now talking about their assessment how to be done individual assessment we can ask questions we can give worksheets oral questions or quiz we can take real situation based questions also we can ask then group assessment reading picture cards related to spatial identification this can be taken for individual as well as for the group assessment so this was the lesson plan for the chapter 1 finding the furry cat i hope it would be helpful to you we'll see you in the next lesson plan till then keep learning